The next set in our strength and power moves looks like this. I'd like you to pick up one foot, just change weight lightly, bend the knee, and let me see the angle behind you. So let me see the foot dangling space for just a second. Then switch sides. So as you shift, I want you to feel what's engaged, the supporting leg. I feel hamstrings, I feel lower leg, and I definitely feel glute insertion. And again, back to that thut, the spot between your butt and your thigh, the thut area. You're going to love it. So that's one of your lower leg moves. The next one is called the froggy. In freestyling, we totally enjoy moves that work more than one area in the body. So let's see what this moves. Take the hands up. I start to feel my chest as I push in. If you look at Carolyn's chest and mine, our bodies are starting to engage. We call that innovation. So we bring it up. I feel my biceps. I'm into my shoulders. Now I want you to extend it in front. Look how nice the arms look. So right now I feel bicep and tricep and lower arm and shoulders and back and chest in one motion. Let's do the complete action. Take it up, engage, and I want you to keep your arms in front. As you come down, we call it the whoosh. I want you to think whoosh and then come up. And again, this action is called the froggy. Now, I don't want you to go too low down. I always want to maintain tension on my band. So find the spot right before you decrease tension to come right back up with a big whoosh. Let's go to work.